Some spite occurs when the skin and tissues underneath the skin freeze. It can happen very quickly in extreme cold or during prolonged exposure to temperatures below zero degrees Celsius. Commonly affected areas include the fingers, toes, ears, nose and chin. There are three stages of frostbite. The first stage involves a change in skin colour, generally to red, and you may feel coldness, numbness or irritated skin. The second stage is superficial frostbite, where the skin will turn white and hard and may start to blister or peel, and it may feel like pins and needles. The third stage is the most dangerous, deep frostbite. The skin will be turning white, blue or blotchy and the tissues underneath feel hard and cold to the touch. As it progresses, the skin and tissues can turn black and hard as they die and the surrounding muscles and joints may stop working. All instances of frostbite should be seen to by a medical professional. However, there are some first aid techniques to use in the interim. In all cases, move the person to a warm area out of the wind and cold. Remove any wet clothing and jewelry around the affected area and warm the body with blankets. Do not rub the affected area as this will cause further damage. For mild to moderate frostbite, gently warm the affected area in warm water of no more than 42 degrees Celsius. The person will likely feel painful tingling as the area warms and strong painkillers may be needed. For severe frostbite, do not try to warm the area. Instead, seek immediate medical attention. The best way to prevent frostbite is to plan ahead. Avoid extreme cold, wear appropriate clothing including face coverings, and move into warm areas as needed. To learn more about how to treat injuries such as frostbite, book in your first aid course today with Australia-wide first aid. With over 75 training locations, we have one near you.